Yo, it's what's Peaky Kid Nate here, and today I'm going to be talking about my final month of Flash series. Now, specifically, I'm going to be talking about the actual sketch part of it because I actually had ideas, and there was some that I even scrapped completely. But yeah, so that's pretty much all I wanted to do. Now, originally, this part I actually this is obviously what I originally planned, and as you can see here, I wanted. Yeah, you can see you can see that it cut off a little bit there as well. So, so obviously, I want I originally wanted it to be you know everything's collapsing. It's like this is the best I could honestly do, but you could def you could definitely see that this was just a green screen I downloaded off the internet. Okay. This one here, I I have no idea why I added this. I have no idea why I added this one here, but. Now, some people might have been wondering why I went gah. The reason for that is the I wasn't just going gah for the sake of going gah. Actually, the thing I was pulling out, which is like a, you know, it's like got it's full of like food and tools and everything. It actually hit me in the side. It as I was pulling it out, it was like it hit me and I was like gah. Like so that was actually gah as in ow. Gonna be in the bunker for a while. Who thought that flash ending would cause the end of the world? Oh yeah, because Adobe Flash was so important to the world that it causes a fucking apocalypse! Yeah, now the thing is, I obviously didn't have a bunker. My original idea was to just be in my room. Uh, I was like, uh, just be in my room, use my wall, and make it look like an actual, like a bunker or a dungeon or whatever. But then I realized that if I did that, I could only have one angle. I couldn't lay on the floor and be like, oh, I'm desperate and everything. So I thought, shit, that won't work. So I, I literally just used, anyone who's seen my YouTube channel for any number of years would know this, the playroom, AKA the storage room. Originally for these sketches, I just wanted them to be mostly uncut, you know, just like showing my descent into madness. But then I realized if I just, Oh, I just added a filter over raw footage with a bit of music. I thought some of these some of these clips were like maybe two to three minutes long and I realized two to three minutes for an intro? Uh, so I decided to cut them down, but instead of making it look forced, like I just cut it. Instead I made it so that the camera glitched. So it's like it's not a problem, it's not it's not me cutting it, it's the fact that the footage was getting corrupted. That was why I did the cut. Okay, okay, uh, uh, day six. I, I found a gun, I found a gun. So yeah, I, I use this gun prop so much, and, uh, saying I found a gun, yeah, it's, it's literally in the toy box. But, yeah, it's, it's one of my props that I've been using for so long. But so far, the, the, like, I made it so it gets darker and less saturated because I'm supposed to be going absolutely insane. That was the idea, and then, at some point it started getting too desaturated and too dark, so I literally had to tone it down a bit. Everything's fine, I don't know how I found a gun, but I think I, I, think I saw a rat going by. Something like a rat, I, like, a, like a big one, a big one. It was like glowing green and everything. I, I, think, I think I killed it, I, I think I killed it. Now, the thing is with some of these cuts as well, some of these cuts might seem completely out of place, but some of them were actually, you know, bad takes. Day seven. Day seven, I actually Now, yeah, that's an apple, obviously, if you can't tell. That was my idea when I saw the apples. I thought, well, I'm supposed to be in this bunker, quote unquote, for an entire month. So I thought, hmm, wouldn't it be more accurate if at some point people actually see me eating food? Because, I mean, it makes sense. You don't think I'm going to be in a bunker for a month and not eat a single bit of food or drink any water. Although, you never see me actually drinking anything. Yeah, a lot of it was off camera. Also, the apple that I was eating, it's the exact same apple throughout the other videos. But, obviously, you know, in different states being eaten and I'm like, Oh, I found multiple apples. It's, it's just so I didn't want to waste multiple apples. Mm, I think I'll wrap bastards around here. You're not taking my fucking apple. Now... The clicking sound, I don't remember if I added that in myself, the clicking of the gun, but I might have added, in fact, I don't think I added that in actually, I think that was just the sound of the trigger, because the trigger's a bit weird, but the, that was a sound that I recorded ages ago, over there on that fish tank, and I made a thudding sound over there, I clipped it, and that was the sound I actually used. Okay, yeah, now, this is one particular shot that I didn't really want to make, 
because I, I realize now that this was a bad idea because it, it essentially it essentially ruins the illusion when you actually see the door to the playroom and realize, hang on a minute, this isn't right. I don't know where it went though. Rick ricocheted a bullet somewhere. Ricochet. I don't know who Ricochet is, but I ricocheted something. <laughs> now, that Ricochet joke, I'm pretty sure that's a joke that I've made in my head so many times. And when I said Ricochet, because I was like, the idea was... Because again, I was thinking as the, I was thinking of this as I was going on. So I was like, "Oh, I shot the wall and it ricocheted." And then I thought, "I don't know who Ricochet is." And I thought, "There we go." And you know, me just trying to be funny. But then, bam! Boom. Not gonna give a shit. Who gives a shit? I don't ask where there's tapes and DVDs over there. I want to keep myself occupied, okay? I want to keep myself fucking occupied. Now, yeah, that's when I realized that that I saw I saw the tapes and the DVDs in the shot, and I thought. Wait, this makes no sense. Why Why would I have tapes and DVDs in a bunker? Why would there be an overturned bed? Why would there be an old bed? Why would there be all this in a in a survival bunker? And I thought, shit. Don't you dare fucking come to my house or I'll do what I did let's happen to you. Okay? Okay? Yeah, you can really tell, you can really tell that I, that I probably should have scripted these videos because I was basically just coasting at this point. I, I had no idea what I was talking about. I was just thinking of what I was going to say next as I was saying it. And there was a lot of, uh, 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 uh. Now, this one is actually the most interesting to me because you can actually see at the bottom there. But what what else is important is I'm not sure how well you can read it. Someone can probably like sharpen the fuck out of it and make it readable. That is actually the file that I use for my video scheduling. Less importantly, running out of videos. Running out of videos. That is probably one of the biggest things. That is bad. Very, very bad. Very not important. What? Now one thing I also planned on doing for this for this particular series is a slow descent into madness, but also visually, not just auditory, not just auditory, but visually showing that I was slowly descending into madness. And I realized for the first few clips, I realized I didn't really look like I was more insane because I mean my hair was barely ruffled up because I mean. Interactive buddy? Yeah, I have an interactive buddy around here! Now the thing with me saying I have an interactive buddy right here, it in the video it came across as I was talking about the gun. Actually, I was talking about the rat, the supposed rat that was around. The, the one that I supposedly shot, or maybe I didn't shoot it, maybe I didn't. So that was what I was actually going for, but I, I pointed the gun so it made it, it made it seem like, oh, I have an interactive buddy right here, my gun. Again, I was talking about the rat, not the gun. But yeah, this is actually a shot that I wasn't really that proud of because, sure, like, it would be nice if there weren't curtains here and a fucking windowsill. Because that kind of defeats the purpose of it supposedly being a bunker. Like everything else, yeah, sure, with the other shot, you can kind of believe it. My, my have been a bunker, you know, because tools, power tools, things like that. But when you have a door, tapes and DVDs, and a fucking window sill, and curtains, it completely destroys the illusion. So, uh, 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 but I, I think the, I think the fallout outside is uh, going, also, going, uh, also, I'm not sure how well you can see down a little bit. A little, a little bit. It's kind of hard to see. Something like it's a... kind of hard to see, but the bed here. The reason that there's actually a bed frame here is because uh, you can probably see it later. But it was act. It was actually basically what happened was is I was younger, and my dad burst into my room. I asked him to leave. He refused to leave, and then I walked up to him, expecting to close the door, and he fucking pushed me on the bed causing me to break the bed frame and if I'm not mistaken I think he still to this day blames me for it like oh I shouldn't have attacked him even though I wasn't going to attack him 
He just pushed me, broke the bed frame, and that's the result. A little bit. There. You see that? Right there. Let's just say that frequently as I walked past that for this, uh, it would hit me in the side. <laughs> especially, like even off camera, especially when I'm setting up the camera, I'd be like, ah, fuck! I might be safe. Somewhat. Uh, uh, that, that rat? Definitely. Yeah, I, I've got two dead rats now. Two dead mutant rats, and I've got like... They're like... Now, I could have cut that a bit better, but yeah, that was when I actually screwed it up. But, uh, yeah, it kind of looks... It's a very, very obvious cut, but I guess I kind of worked it in by saying like, Oh, well, the camera footage glitched, so it got rid of it, but, you know... I had full control over how much I showed, so yeah, that was nothing to do with the camera, that was my fault. Uh, yeah, this is the one where I realised that I wasn't making enough insanity progress, and I realised, well, people can't really see me going insane, I mean, they can hear me going insane, but then I realized at this point I had to do something drastic to show that I was actually going insane. But the only thing I could think of was both messing with my hair and wearing my shirt on my head. Like, you know, I am the great cornholio. <laughs> I need TP for my bunghole. That was that was basically my idea. So something like that. I apparently started religion. <laughs> uh, the dead rats are my uh uh, cult assistance, <laughs> or, or some, something like that. I <laughs> Notice how I said, I saw the religion, and then the next sentence, the rats are my cult assistants. So I say I started a religion, and then immediately say a cult. That honestly wasn't intentional, that was literally just me being so fucking stupid and not scripting it, that I pretty much immediately forgot that I said religion and not cult. So I could have I could have said, the rats are my bishops, the rats are this, the rats are that, the rats are my Jehovah's Witnesses, spreading the good word. No, I said cult. And I admit, I went from a religion to a cult leader. That, that was not intentional, but I worked at it anyway. No idea what's happening anymore, but I think I started a cult. Something See? like that. Uh, 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 uh. I don't even know anymore. Is, if anyone is still out there, HELP! Also, with the Super Mario Flash 2 video, uh, I showed it as well. For some reason, even though the website is still up and everything, the game still works, the website is still up, for some str and Actually, I don't know if the website is still up at this point, but for some reason, as I was playing it, just random codes for levels just wouldn't work at all. I think I scrap- I think I cut, like, almost like 10 20 minutes out of just me looking for working chords and even though the chord is there the level was up the chord was there it just wouldn't work one for the rat that's in here and uh possibly one for me right in the head right in the head oh my fucking god help me help me so much you just sit there and laugh you just sit there and laugh at my fucking flash videos Oh, you will fucking laugh at them. You will fucking laugh at them. <laughs> also, before you ask about all the toilet paper, because I know that some people have probably already thought to themselves, why is there so much toilet paper? No, this wasn't a pandemic thing. My dad just does that all the time. Even before the pandemic, years and years and years ago before the pandemic, he always stocked up on toilet paper. So, so, uh, uh, it's, it's day 21, and I have found that, uh, the radiation outside is going down. It's definitely- Oh, no, this one- Okay, so for this one, when I showed the radiation thing, which is literally just MS Paint, it's, you know, it's meant to be the mad scramble- It's meant- it's meant to be, like, the mad scribblings of someone who's going insane. Legitimately, when I was doing that, I wanted to search up some kind of, like, fake radiation check thing. Like, like a, like as a, as a joke obviously, like a joke website like geektyper.com where it shows like fake hacking and all that. I wanted to show some kind of like fake radiation chart, but as I was looking up like radiation charts, 
I couldn't find any of them that look anywhere decent, so I just changed it to, oh, it's the mad scribblings of a mad person. Don't. If I can get out of here, that's good food. That actually helps. I might be fine. I might be fine. Because the internet just came back somehow. Yeah, like, that one really didn't make any sense. That's why I added that in. Like, the internet went out? Oh, it's like, it's like, at no point did I ever state that the internet went out. And if so, like, if we're saying like, oh, the, the house upstairs, you know, crumbled or whatever, or it, or it was something like that, yeah, the route would probably die, or, oh, the telephone pole's outside, that would make more sense. But then just all of a sudden, the internet came back. That added nothing. That added absolutely nothing in my personal opinion. I could have easily said, oh, I had a generator and I made my own internet connection. That would have that would have been funnier, in my opinion. Would have made less, it would have made pretty much as equal sense, but it would have been funnier instead of just saying, my internet came back. Uh, might be able to get an extra video out. Maybe, possibly. But right now, I think by tomorrow, maybe, tomorrow or the day after, I might be fine. I might be getting out of here. Uh, I combed my hair a little bit with uh, my hands and, uh, I think I'm finally calming down. Now, at this point, I actually, believe it or not, had two or three extra videos, but I realized that as I was doing it, I realized, like, it was like, oh, I'm I think I'm finally calming down. Like, it, it's like, I think I'm finally calming down. I think I'm finally ready to get out. The very next video, oh my God, I'm going fucking insane. It's like, I, I realized that not only was it like, it. Like, you can see that it's brighter now, it's less, there's less of a vision in it. Because I wanted to make it seem like I was getting better, but instead I just got worse and worse and worse and worse. And it originally got to the point where the vignette was just so squashed and it was so desaturated. So I thought, no, you know what? You know what, I'm just going to scrap those. Uh, I'll move right on the Dangerous Christmas. This was actually originally meant to be for the, uh the highlight reel, believe it or not. This was actually meant to be for the highlight reel where I eventually get out and then realize the very next video, oh, end of the world again. But I instead made it for Dangerous Christmas instead. So it's like, oh, I get out on Christmas day and I have a few videos where I don't have to sketch because I'm out. Ha <laughs> Don't ask where I got this life from. My continuity, my video, fuck off. <laughs> I actually struggled to close it. Like, I really wanted it to be like, uh, haha! And it was like completely dark, but instead it was like, haha! It was like, haha! And I'm really not proud of this shot because I really wanted it to be like, you know, it goes dark, and then it suddenly. Right. But then I, I kind of ruined it by having my laptop in the shot, and I, for some reason, didn't refilm it. And I, I hate that about it. I, I honestly really wanted to refilm that. I don't know why I, I included the other parts, but I... Yeah, this video is like an hour long and I'm going to cut so much out of this, but yeah. I... That was... That was me just commentating over... My my stuff. Yeah, I... Fit it in. So anyway, I've been your host, Pika Kid Edit. It's been Pika Kid Edit Reacts, and you've all been fantastic. So until the next video, I say bye-bye.